Mercy for Animals recently released a video documenting the torturing of chickens by Tyson Foods. Tyson Foods is the largest meat producer in the world, and I don't see this video changing that. The video was released July 8th, and their stock price has barely been affected, though it is still a little early. While it's easy for me to look at this behavior by Tyson in disgust, it's hard for me to do more than just that. The Mercy for Animals website has a petition you can sign, and I can muster the energy to do that just because it requires very little of me. But I won't do the other things the website suggests. I'm not going to share this because I don't want the people on my social media to think that I'm a vegan activist. I'm not going to donate because I only have limited funds and I decide to donate to charities that help children, such as the Jeff Gordon Children's Foundation. Yes, I'm a NASCAR fan. Judge accordingly. I'm also not going to take action or learn more because I don't have unlimited time in the day, and I'm definitely not going to choose veg because I love meat too much. Steak and shrimp are some of the best foods on the planet. And since when is it called Veg? Is this a newer, sleeker name to make the vegan movement sound cooler? Maybe it's just because this makes it closer to the word Vag, and more guys will pay attention. If you want to be a vegan, that's your choice, and it's absolutely fine by me. Just don't shove it in my face. If you want to shove something in my face, make sure it's a steak. But why is it so easy for me to sit back and watch something like this, but then do absolutely nothing about it? It's because I, like most people, just don't care enough. It's not that I don't want to care, but if I was to worry about everything bad in this world, I would probably be so overwhelmed by the pain and agony that I would commit suicide. I have responsibilities to work, school, friends, and hobbies, and I can't allow myself to be consumed by grief. So I just look at this and say, well, that's bad, and go on living my life like normal. I guess one other easy thing I could do is stop buying Tyson chicken, but I'm not going to do that. And it's not because Tyson chicken is just so absurdly delicious that I can overlook Mercy for Animals findings and continue to eat it, but because I already don't buy Tyson chicken. I buy Publix brand. Because it's cheaper. Well, I'm off to enjoy a nice, medium rare steak. Y'all have a good one.